My name's Nick Trebak. I'm 16. I'm Jim Waterhouse. I'm 16 years old. I think that 95% of Australian companies are run by men because... Oh. Maybe, maybe it's because men think of themselves as more dominant or um, are more aggressive. I think that 95% of Australian companies are run by men because men are seen as more intimidating. My name's Peter Sikonis, I'm 16. Hi, I'm Ben Elder, I'm 16. Um, we still have the mindset that men should be in power. But there's also that, that action of men, men giving jobs to men just because they're like mates or something. My name's Will Baker, I'm 16. I'm Patrick Michael Hoggett, I'm 15 years old. There's clear evidence and stuff that women are paid as much as men. I've heard a couple of stories from my mum saying that um, her job, even though she owns the same, she does the same job as a man, the man gets a higher pay, which to me is just outrageous. I didn't know that women got pay, get paid less than uh, men. That's actually really upsetting, considering my mum has worked in management her whole life, and she works so hard to get where she is. Hi, my name's Reid McNamara, um, just turned 16. Men are sort of um, hiding away in their little box because they know that um, when, when problems come, they need to be tough. When they really don't, they need to speak out, and it's all right to show emotions. I think females, in my opinion, uh, tend to sort of get around each other a little bit more um, when they might be struggling mentally or, or physically or whatnot. Um, and males sort of tend to um, get on with it. There's sort of a stigma around males my age that you always have to be all right and just keep your head up all the time. Say, say it as a weakness, um, and they're not really comfortable talking to their friends or or their family for that matter um, about issues. It's more of a manly thing to move on and just pretend everything's okay where we think girls, they're always supporting each other. You see so many things on the news about young women being um, approached or physically harmed by older men or younger men. Girls, as sad as it sounds, girls get judged a lot more. They get called sluts if they upload a photo with too much butt or if they're wearing short shorts they get judged. I do think there are some terms that are used to describe a girl with a lot of boyfriends that are used differently for a guy with a lot of girlfriends. Boys should um, stop asking for inappropriate photos to start off with. That's really rude and disrespectful. Whereas a guy, say if a guy like gets around a lot, it's, it's sort of uh, seen as admirable. We've been told at school, um, if on the way home, that maybe a woman is in front of us and um, she may feel threatened or scared that we're walking behind her or like uh, she may feel threatened that we may be following her or something. So we just got to walk over to the other side of the road. And I think my dad is a judge for being the stay at home dad. I tell friends that, oh yeah, my dad's a stay at home dad. And they look at me funny like, why doesn't he work? Like. He should be the one making the money. I think the reason we don't see many men making the choice to stay home and look after their families is because they feel as if society would look at them as less masculine and take them not as seriously. They might feel that the mother might do a better job or be a bit more loving. Um, I, sort, I sort of think emotionally um, a father can't really um, open up as much as a mother. Um, as, as mentioned earlier, um, it's sort of a, uh, a weakness to, to open up um, to your kids as well. I have a younger brother, I don't have any sisters. When you're growing up, you always hear about the stereotypes of the women's, the people in the household and the men are out there earning the money. We have um, a lot of chores, a lot of work. It's mostly outside work, we help dad. And I can see where it's going with the female roles inside the house. The things my mum do is more the little things that no one really notices. The early morning lunch, so making sandwiches when no one else is up. The different, like getting, getting clothes out for my little brothers to wear. I think that we, we celebrate International Women's Day because women play a very important role in all of our lives. That can be overlooked by society. Everyone should be equal and um, no matter what your gender, Everyone has the same role in society and that's just to take care of each other.